Hi, welcome to the course on SAP New ABAP Syntax. So what is New ABAP Syntax or Modern ABAP Syntax? SAP has introduced New ABAP Syntax from the ABAP release 7.4 onwards, which is often referred as a New ABAP Syntax or Modern ABAP, which increases the efficiency of the code and also makes it easy for the developers. The new ABAP syntax also reduces the number of code lines which we need to do to meet the same functionalities. The new language features have been added without taking away the old syntax. This means that in the same system we can use old ABAP syntax as well as the new syntax. We can use the new ABAP syntax in both ECC system and as well as in s hana system as it is based on the ABAP release 7.4 onwards. Here if you can see the screenshot on the left hand side this is of EC system with the HANA, HANA DB and here you can see the ABAP release is 7.4. On the right hand side this is from s hana and the release is 7.4 7.5. Now, if you're working in any system, how to check the release of a app? After login, go to system and then click on this status. After that, click on this detail button. Then you will able to see the app release in that particular system. So what are the new features introduced by SAP? in ABAP 7.4 or 7.5. The very first features in the new ABAP syntax is an inline declaration. The inline declaration is a new way of declaring internal tables, work area, variables, etc. We can declare them at the same position where we are using. Along with inline declaration, there are many other features like table expressions, read table syntax, checking a particular value of internal table, getting the index number. There are different operators are there like conversion operators, casting operator, value operator, corresponding operator. Then there are also changes in the select query and union, union all, a new way of concatenation some features are available in 7.4 and some are introduced from 7.5 onwards. As in each release, SAP adds some new features. So some differences are there in the 7.4 and 7.5. So this all we will learn in this course how to make use of new ABAP syntax while doing the ABAP coding.